Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be diving into a brand new song and music video from our amazingly talented Princess Putri Ariani that she released last week. And I know I'm a little bit late to this and I apologize, but you know, better late than ever, honestly. Let's let's be honest, you know. <laughs> so um, this new song from her is called Crown. And I'm very excited because you never know what you're going to get with Ariani, uh, or with uh, Putriani. I'm combining names now, damn it. Putri, Ariani, you never know what you're going to get from her every time she does this a new song. So let's just dive, let's dive straight into this. I'm so excited. Here we go. Racing through the lights, feeling so alive. Oh. This is different. This is like almost like a trap, like rap beat. Whoa, what are you giving us here, girl? Interesting. Okay, I'm intrigued. Racing through the lights, feeling so alive. Ooh, we got dancers. Taking every chance. There's no compromise. Taking control. It's my turn and I won't back down. Uh, rock now? Okay. What? Our princess has gone EDM rock on us now. Oh my god. Wow, I am uh, I am in love with this. This is this is my kind of style. I mean, if you guys have seen anything else on my YouTube outside uh, my Pucci Ariani uh, Ariani videos, you know it's all like J-pop, K-pop, P-pop and like rock and metal and stuff like that j rock you know you know what i mean i mean this is sick i love this experimentation of going into this more of a uh like harder hitting like style for her this is so sick and it, honestly it works really well because the fact that the, the song is clearly all about like i'm taking my crown i'm going to the top you know and I feel like, like, if you were to do that into, like, her more of her, like, somber, more, like, uh, kind of ballad style that she's, like, known for, I don't think it would work. To go with this more heavy-hitting, like, you know, almost, like, trap, rock, hip-hop style, like, production, and going with this idea of, like, yo, I'm gonna take my crown because I'm a boss, you know? Like, it works so well with that. Oh, my gosh. This is sick. Are we getting into a new era of, of our princess here? Are we going to start seeing this more often, or is this like her just showing off how she can do anything she wants? She's so diverse. Oh, let's keep going. This is sick. Story, I get that piano in there. Of course. Mmm, that's a good line. Ah, uh, what was that? I'm sorry. I, I'm, I, I'm, I'm, I'm so focused on the the production being the music producer. I'm that's like what I'm focused on. But what was that line? Something like I'm, something in the stars. I'm focused on. My side, I'm chasing the stars. I'm ready to fight. Yeah, I'm chasing the stars. I'm ready. I think it's either fight or flight. I think it's fight. But that's a sick line right there. And I love like her and just making sure she stays true to herself. Always making sure she's got that piano with her on by her side. If there's anything we know that like our princess here is good at is just incorporating that piano any way she can because that's part of who she is. So I love that she's still doing that part too. Um, also, oh my gosh, shout out to these dancers that they got for this music video. This music video, in terms of like the the um, 
editing and the different like, types of like transitions and like little stutter effects and the camera shaking are so like top notch. Like she's got herself a hell of a crew with her. I mean, I know her mom and her dad. I think have a bit to do with her stuff too. Um, but yeah, this is next level. This is so impressive. I love this. I love this. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, you're you're not just gonna do that that little run for us there one time, Miss Thel Thang. Uh uh. Also, I love this line of like, I'm gonna lead Rama live. Like, I love that. Like, yes, she's still young herself, and obviously very much, you know, growing into becoming a full, you know, you know, grown adult, we'll say. But the fact that she's so young, but yet she's here saying, like, look, I'm going to take my crown, I'm going to wear it proudly, and I'm going to lead while I'm still alive. I'm going to lead while I can. I'm going to basically be the best influence I can on people who listen to my music. I'm going to inspire people. I'm going to show them my story, tell my story, and show them that nothing will ever get in your way if you have the right mindset. And she's saying, like, you know, I got my dreams on my side. That's right, because her dreams are right by her side, and she's living them right now. Her dreams are not going to leave her side, because she is fulfilling her dreams right now, right in, like, front of our eyes, basically, you know? <laughs> Um, but I love that line so much. That is so powerful. I'm a lead while I'm still alive. I'm gonna live by that. That is amazing. But sorry, we gotta do that run again one more time, because let's be honest, she's known for the runs. We gotta do it again. Come on, here we go. <laughs> Woo! Damn! That's so cool. I love this. This is cool. Showing all these times she's been on the different types of shows that she's been on. From her being a little young little girl here, to being a little bit older, to her being still kind of young here. And then all these different like things she did about... Well, this one looks like she was on... This looks like it was probably from when she was a kid. On one of the uh, shows maybe in... I can't tell. I can't remember also where she was before when she was a kid. But anyways, and then here, right here, her infamous audition from America's Got Talent that put her on the map, brought her to her win, and ultimately to stardom. I love that she reflects on this because this is basically her showing, like, I got my dreams on my side, and here's proof. Here are my dreams coming true right before my eyes in this, like, version of a TV, basically, or whatnot, like where we are basically watching it, and then she can go back and watch it too. She is capable. She is in a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity here where she can go back onto YouTube and go watch her audition and be like, that is the moment that my life changed forever. This audition right here changed my life. And she can go back and watch that and see her progress and what she's done to get to where she is now. And that is something that not many people are able to do. And that makes me so proud of her. And I love that I get to be on this journey with her and see her just completely blow up in this insanely massive star and somebody who's just here to change the entire world. And at such a young age, too. I mean, my goodness, she is just impeccable. What an incredible human being she is and what an honor it is to be on this earth and in this moment in time where we can see this happening for our eyes. Let's go! Yes! Mm. Oh! 
Oh, that guitar! Damn! Wow. <laughs> Love it. Okay, wait, wait. I gotta see who did all this. <clears throat> okay, so obviously starring her. She's some singer. She did the... Okay, so she wrote the song. She composed it. She also produced it. Poochie is out here producing, like, this kind of stuff, the rock and EDM stuff. Oh, my God. Oh, my Lord. Okay, yeah, see, I, I knew it. Yeah, see, their excuse to the executive producers, sorry, were her mom and her dad, because they always are involved with her stuff, which is so cool. I can't believe she wrote this. I mean, I knew that she produces, like, 9% of her stuff anyways, if not all of her stuff, but for her to produce a song like this... I mean, this is a highly impressive. This is, like, this is the kind of stuff that you see, like, people hiring, like, professional producers to do. This is, like, high-quality, like, K-pop producer type, like, you know, production here. Like, for her to do this by herself, I mean, with a little bit of help, obviously, from her mom and her dad, is insane. Like, oh my gosh, she is incredible. Let's keep going, sorry. Let's finish the show. Oh, is this off her album that was coming? It must be. I completely forgot. You guys had mentioned this before in the last time I did a reaction that she was going to be doing or finally releasing an entire album. So this is off of her album, it looks like. Because I can see right here the uh, track list here. Stay with me if I, love was never there. It's a game. Hey, how are you? Good, so goodbye. Sheepish. There's Crown. Sheepish. Yeah, that's what I reacted to last time. Something in her language, I'm guessing. Another thing in her language. Another thing in her language. Loneliness. I think I've reacted to loneliness. Perfect Liar. I think we've heard that before, too. Okay. I completely forgot this album coming. Oh, I'm excited to listen to this. Okay. Oh, my gosh. Let's go. Okay, not only did she drop a banger of a track, now she's got the whole album out too. I mean, she's about to take the world by storm, guys. I mean, she already has been, but this album I think is going to put her on the map. If this album doesn't get like major traction to the point of possibly even being able to like win like a Grammy, then we are failing in the music industry. We are failing miserably because, I mean, this song right here might be one of her best ones yet. Not only in terms of like the impressiveness of the production value, the music video itself, and the lyrics and everything. I mean, the whole idea of this basically being like the perfect song for her to have on this album and for her to promote the album is amazing because it's basically like her saying like, hey, I've been on this journey for, I think it's been like, what, two years now or something like that. I finally got this album out. I'm ready to give you all what I got. I have got my crown, I'm putting it on, I'm ready to lead till the day I die, I am ready to follow my dreams, I got my dreams right on my side, right here following along with me, and they're not going anywhere because my dreams are just starting, and they're only going to get better and better, they're going to keep growing, and I'm going to keep fulfilling more and more of them, and I'm going to put myself on the map, that's exactly what she's doing, and I could not be more proud, I mean, honestly, it just blows my mind that, like, probably like a mere, like, Maybe a year ago, actually, I don't think it's probably been two years, but like about like pretty much a year ago, I was sitting here reacting to her on that AGT stage, doing a performance in hopes that she could have her dreams come true, and become a worldwide phenomenon. And here she is now, a year or so later, putting out her first ever album with multiple music videos, a massive fan base, and still doing it all on her own with some assistance, of course, from people also, but. She's the one doing her own songwriting, producing, composing, all by herself. And, I mean, like I said, we're, we're, we're witnessing a once-in-a-lifetime superstar being born be right before our eyes. And I, I can't say how honored I am to be able to be a part of this journey with her. 
and to see her become a superstar right in front of us in this day and age. I, I'm honestly so honored. I can't even, I can't express that enough. But anyways, guys, um, if there's any songs off this album that you know that I absolutely have to hear, you want to see me do a reaction to, please let me know in the comments down below. And of course, um, you know, if she drops any more music videos for this um, from this album, I will of course be doing reactions to that also. So you can look forward to those too if they come out in the future. But more than anything, guys, if y'all enjoyed this video, go ahead and drop a like, subscribe to the channel if you know it already, and of course, I'll drop my Poochie Ariani reaction video, reaction videos playlist. There we go <laughs> over here for y'all to check out. And of course, more than anything, everybody, thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next video. Under you guys, bye. <laughs>